okay so druti uh, welcome on your free education and thanks a lot for your time and congratulations for your selection in prestigious npcl thanks to you sir for your guidance and support i really wanted to i was actually about to call kavita ma'am uh, so, uh, because i wanted a slot to talk to you and luckily she came uh, she i got a call from her uh, saying that you'll be having an interaction se uh, section with vijayendra sir so, thank you so much sir it's like even in the interview a uh, few questions like directly which you people were asking in the mock interviews those questions have been asked directly in the interview so it really helped me a lot okay so kili uh, this uh, this entire interaction uh, we want to have uh, uh, related to your entire journey so first i start with your brief introduction please tell us about you first uh, sir uh, i am kili saidruti Uh, i have done my b in mechanical engineering from uh, pune university sir uh, that is in the year 2015 in the 2015 uh, i have attempted gate i qualified it and joined nit surat to pursue mtech in cat cam and uh, in 2017 there in the campus selection itself uh, i got uh, uh, you know job in uka tarsadiya university as an assistant professor there i served for 2 years that is till 2019 and in 2019 i got married and i shifted to bangalore and moreover it's like uh, i always wanted to join up uh, psu sir so i started preparing for psus so i have attempted gate 2020 and with i got one uh, 1099 rank and therein after i started applying for uh, phd's as well and as well as psus so luckily after a very long time i got a call from npcl and after that uh, i was not knowing ki uh, i don't know the path actually because i have never been to such a prestigious interview so i have been uh, flipping through various uh, channels and all and uh, luckily one day i have uh, got this uh, some uh, video uh, of yourpedia so immediately i have joined yourpedia so so it's like uh, but i should say i would have joined it little earlier so that i could have made complete use of it somewhere also i feel like uh, I, I, you know even two mock interviews were pending and one more um, uh, snap you snap interviews were pending if i have used them also i would have grabbed even more knowledge i think so so uh, luckily the interviews or experience i have written the questions also i'll be sending those questions to you via whatsapp few questions which you people were asking in the interview different mentors were asking in the interview those questions directly came directly those questions were asked in the main interview also so actually dhruti what happens is and most of the interviews you know questions normally are same but it is only practice and the hesitation in candidates like if you practice more than the way to answer their impromptu and uh, that that thing is actually uh, that expertise can be acquired that is what yeah. i feel so yes. it's a really good wonderful that you got selected you know why why interacting with you is uh, inspiring because you know after marriage you know uh, girls think that the career now they cannot uh, change the career if i say uh, that way you were teaching you were in teaching profession and then you thought of getting into public sector there there were less case of that type that after 2 years of teaching now you are planning to after marriage you are planning to get into please tell us what difficulties difficulties uh, did you face to reach up to this uh, stage sir as you said it's like before marriage if you try doing something then it's like you can even spend almost like 10 hours preparing something okay then uh, i'll add one more difficulty sir i was 3 months pregnant when i gave gate 2020 so especially you know 2 3 uh, months prior to get that is very crucial time uh, so you have to spend lot of time studying practicing etc etc and that time was really hectic for me because on one side i have to take care of myself also my own health and at the same time i should be concentrating on my career also so um, uh, that was the main difficulty i faced and even after giving birth to the baby uh, she was born on august 9th sir 2020 so even after that even while for preparing npcil uh, you know uh, for, even for the mock interviews i faced difficulty because that timing and i have to take care of my baby as well as i have to attend the study and i have to attend interviews also uh, see sir you will laugh if i say few mentors used to ask me uh, did you really prepare and came here for the mock uh, then i was like oh my god how can i go for the main interview if this is the case uh but still then i told them he sir i am preparing but 
I am not actually sure of the way because I am going through gate books, my notes is all my running notes I have written and all. Then they said, no, this is not the thing. Gate is done. You should not go with that right now. So see so and so book, see so and so material. Your path should be this. You have to think in this way. So for example, sir, uh, my M Tech project was on production. Okay, uh, man manufacturing. Sorry, but while giving manufacturing mock interview i was going through all manufacturing process etc etc but sir has not asked even a single question from that his entire focus was on cad cam the mtech subjects which i have studied and the softwares which i have worked on so then i got to know ki, yeah this is the way then i have to see these first and later on i have to go through those so even in the main interview uh, they have questioned almost uh, about around 15 minutes on the project I have done. The, what's your project, application, kya hai, etc., etc. Deep into the process I have done, etc. So even that helped me a lot. Yeah, Dhruti, it is really quite inspiring to know that uh, what difficulties you are facing and you reached up to this stage. So eventually you got selected in NPCL. Now I'm coming to the next part. Uh, you got selected in NPCL. How are you going to manage now? Uh, where you will get joining and how these things will be managed now? But uh, you must be thinking uh, now for that. Yeah, even like last two days, I was not even sleeping properly because this is the next level tension, sir. That was a different part. Okay, that was cross. But now it's like a 13 month old baby and a family, everything. And uh, she was quite dependent on me as of now. And so I have been thinking like, what should I do? Because anyways, I have to join. So I'm trying to balance both these. I'll go there and see the condition over there. If possible, I'll ask my mother along with my baby to shift or else we'll see ki how she is accommodating here. Uh, could she manage without me? If yes, then all right. I had uh, got, I have got training in, uh, sorry, site is Rajasthan site, sir. So I have to go there. So we are just checking out ki, uh, how would it, it how is it manageable could we take her also or else uh, would she be fine here we were checking all those things right now yeah so that is the new thing now you are thinking new tension huh? yeah new tension okay <laughs> so uh, still Druti, this baby is very lucky for you looks like you got a uh, selected lucky, job she brought job for you yeah, uh, anyhow, uh, yeah i mean now last question to you uh, Druti, now is there are so many girl candidates who are to overcome because I remember my interaction with so many such candidates. You are lucky you got selected. There are many who are still in the process of fighting. You know, yes. they are after seven years of marriage life, they are planning to come back to professional, uh, you know, uh, life yes. and they want to start their career. What is your advice to all of them? Uh, sir, first of all, sir, uh, as a woman, I would say, he don't uh, leave one thing for the other it's like no i want to get married so i leave my professional life i want to give a birth i want to leave my professional or else i want to get settled so i would plan my baby later i would get married later both these strings are wrong you should always try to balance your professional career as well as your personal life in a balanced manner of course you have to uh, do many sacrifices for example i had i got married on may 26 2019 sir and my husband is working in bangalore and uh, on june 10th i have left bangalore and shifted to pune so that i could get proper time and i could focus on the study so newly married couple, we were not staying together. I came, uh, I left him and came to my place and started studying. So uh, my advice would be you should keep balancing both the things together. Do not leave one thing for the other and always stay focused because even after giving birth to baby or something, you have to face 100 times more struggles because today hardly if I count each and every minute of the day, then hardly I can get, I can spare three to four hours for my studies. That too, after working, after my baby, after looking after my baby and everything, hardly I'll get three to four hours, which means you have to uh, be three times more focused after your personal life reach, reaches this place. Uh, this is what I suggest for the uh, women, those who are studying, sir. It's a perfect, um, Dhruti, you know, this is a different kind of inspirational uh, journey you had and I'm very sure your journey is going to inspire thousands of girls over there and many of us 
that uh, if you can uh, come over all these difficulties why can't others yes, who have all yes, the time available right yes, sir. Yes, really sir. thanks to you uh, thank thanks a lot druti for yes. sharing your experience with all of us here and we wish you all the very best thank you so much sir and uh, vijan sir especially you whenever i call you you pick up the phone and you used to say hello druti what's it man so i was like you were remembering each and every candidate's name and you were interacting with them that was the first point which is quite inspiring sir because it it feels more like you are our teacher no he is there he'll talk to us he'll guide us he'll tell us this is the thing which keeps boosting us thank you so much for that sir thank you so thank, much and thank I'll, you. i'll send you the questions via whatsapp sir either I'll, either you. i'll send it to kavita ma'am or you yeah. sir i'll send thank, the questions thank you druti thank you so much